Catch. <gasps> How did you do that? Watch, take the head of lettuce and turn it into a salad. How did I not see that coming? Mm -hmm. What is this? From my cookie. What's good? Welcome back to How To Magic. Oh, oh, magic! I am your host, Evan Era. Today I'm showing you five magic food tricks that you can do at home. I'm not a foodie. So if you're ready, hit that thumbs up button for me and let's go. This first one's a classic food trick that you can do on the grill this summer. Check it out. Done. I'm about to reveal the secret. The secret to this trick is extremely simple, and I'll teach you how it's done right now. Okay, here is how to make an onion volcano. The first thing you're going to need is one large white onion, and your first step is to slice the onion up into rings. This is what you need right here is one slice of onion. So once you have your slice, you're gonna open up the rings just like this, separate them on the onion until you get down to the very small center rings. I'm just gonna pop those out. Now you're going to assemble them in height order to create your volcano. So start with the biggest, then the next, then the next. And just like that, you have assembled your onion volcano. Now the next step is how you create the flame. Here's what you're going to need to create the magic fire from the volcano and make it erupt. You're going to need some vegetable oil, a little squeeze bottle to put it in, and you'll also need some 80 proof vodka. This is alcohol. Obviously, if you're a kid, you'll need an adult's help with this, and you'll need another squeeze bottle for your alcohol. So one bottle gets filled with the alcohol, and the other bottle you're going to fill with your vegetable oil. This is what's going to initially ignite the flame, and then it's gonna catch the oil on fire, and that is what's gonna make it look like our volcano is just magically erupting. What's happening? Uh, this is the butterfly trick. <laughs> In the butterfly trick? No. No? Pretty cool. Okay. Catch. <gasps> Don't! That's why. <laughs> <laughs> So all you really need to pull this off is a softened stick of butter. And then you ask them if they want to see the butterfly trick, and then all you do is toss them a stick or a slab of butter, and watch them freak out as they try and catch it or drop it on the floor. It'll get their hands covered with butter, super messy, but it's an easy cleanup. Just go to the sink and wash your hands. Okay, this is the cookies and milk challenge. You ready for this? Yes, I'm so ready. Right. I love Oreos. So we have some milk and some cups here. V, you have a cup of milk, I have a cup of milk. Yes. You have a cookie, I have a cookie. So here is the object that we're gonna see who can dunk their cookie the fastest without breaking it. Seems pretty easy, yeah. but it's a matter of it who is quickest, okay? okay? You ready on the count of three? Here we go. One, two, three, go. setting this up is you're going to make some oobleck. It's two parts cornstarch to every one part water and then mix it up. And once you have it mixed, this is what you get. This is oobleck. It's just cornstarch and water and it's a non-Newtonian fluid. And now if you try to dunk anything into it fast, it feels like a solid. You can't penetrate the surface of the liquid. No matter how hard you try, it cannot get through. But if you go slow, It'll sink right in. So you're gonna fill a glass from the kitchen with some oobleck just like this. And it really does look like milk once it settles and the top of it gets completely smooth. This reminds me of like uh, the stuff they use in TV commercials to like mimic real food and make it look better. It's like what they put in cereal and commercials. So it looks exactly like milk, but when they go to dunk their cookie in, you can't dunk it because it's completely solid. The key is to go slowly. Cookies. Mm -mm. May I have one of your tasty treats? No. No? Seriously, I can't have one? <laughs> no. <laughs> like one. one. Just one. Watch. Okay. If I take it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How did you do that? How did you do that? Don't mess with Oreos. 
Okay, here is the secret to the magic bite out cookie trick. So this is not a normal cookie. It's actually a rubber cookie. So as you can see, it has a little rubber band that runs along the outside edge. That's what holds the halves of the Oreo together. It looks really convincingly like an actual Oreo cookie, except it's made of a pliable rubber. So now all you have to do to make it look like you bite the cookie is simply bend this top part back just like this and hold it in place with your thumb. And now from the front, it really looks like a cookie that's had a bite taken out of it. And now to make it pop back in place, all you do is let the pressure off of the back and it'll pop right back up just like that. So it's really simple. Take the cookie, bite. It's gonna act like you have it in your mouth. Just, mm -hmm. And then all the while you're gonna be holding your thumb against this cookie on the back and you're gonna hold it in place just like this. And then when you're ready to spit the piece of the cookie back on and make it magically restore, all you have to do is let that pressure off with your thumb and it'll pop back into place. Super easy to do. Stay tuned for the end of the video for a special giveaway. We also have these magic bite out cookies available at EvaneraTV.com. There's a link in the description. It's a super easy magic trick that anyone can do. Get yours today. Okay, really cool food trick here. I have a head of lettuce and I have a salad bowl, empty salad bowl. So check this out. We're gonna Take the head of lettuce and try to do something a little magical. Watch, we take the salad bowl just like this. If we put it over the head of lettuce just like that, it kind of looks like the lettuce just magically shreds into a salad just like that. Help me. The first thing you're going to need for this trick is a full head of lettuce, just like this. You can get this from the grocery store or the supermarket. You're going to need some shredded lettuce just like this. It can be cut up in a bag, like pre-shredded for you, or you can just get a head of lettuce and shred some up yourself. You're gonna take your knife and just cut the head of lettuce. Just like that. So now we want to remove the inner layers of lettuce so that we're just left with the outer shell. It should begin to naturally separate just like this. And you can kind of take it out layer by layer. So now we've essentially got a shell that's empty on the inside, but when we sit it this way, it looks like a cut head of lettuce. The next thing you're going to need is a magnet and you're going to put it down in the bottom of the lettuce. And you wanna secure the magnet in the bottom of the lettuce using some hot glue. Once you've secured the magnet in the lettuce with the hot glue, let it harden and the hot glue will hold it in place. Your next step is to get another magnet and secure it on the top of a salad bowl. So you need a big plastic salad bowl just like this. And then you're going to tape the magnet in place on the bottom of the salad bowl just like this. So now that you have the head of lettuce shell with the magnet secured inside and you have the bowl with the magnet taped on top, when you flip this over, it looks like a head of lettuce just sitting on the counter. So now it looks like you're just holding a head of lettuce and then when you place the bowl over top of it, the magnet will attract and it looks like the lettuce has just disappeared. Here. It's actually just stuck inside the bowl because of the magnet. So you just wanna be careful not to flash this to your audience. You can set the bowl down on the counter to hide the lettuce shell. Now our next step before the performance starts is we're going to fill our shell with some shredded lettuce. So we're just gonna fill it up as much as we can with shredded lettuce just like this. Now we wanna flip it over on our hand just like that. Now you're ready to start the performance. So then you can say, check this out. I have a head of lettuce here and I have a salad bowl. All the ingredients to make a salad. Let's see if I can just instantly make one just like that. So what happens here is the magnet contacts the top of the head of lettuce. It's going to lift the head of lettuce off and all the shredded lettuce inside is gonna fall out and it looks like it just magically turns into shredded lettuce for a salad. Like the head of lettuce just magically shreds in an instant. And now you know the secret of performing the instant salad trick at home. Try it out. All right, that is it for this video. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button and share it with someone who you think might like it as well. And it is giveaway time. I'm giving away five magic bite out cookies to five lucky comments in the comment section down below. Win a free bite out cookie from EvanerraTV.com. All you have to do to win is leave a like on the video and a comment in the comment section. So leave as many comments as you want. The more comments you leave on the video, the better your chances of winning. And it's time to announce the giveaway winners from our last How To Magic video. The winners are magically appearing on the screen right here. Congratulations to our winners. Be sure to send your full mailing address to this email address on the screen right here to claim your prize. Thank you to everyone for entering that giveaway and good luck to everyone entering this giveaway. Be sure to hit the thumbs up on the video and leave your comments down below. If you like this episode of How To Magic, be sure to subscribe to our channel. We explore different concepts and magic in our videos every single week. Catch. <gasps> How did you do that? Watch, take the head of lettuce and turn it into a salad. How did I not see that coming? Ooh, ooh. What is this? Oh my God.
my cookie. If you missed the last episode of How To Magic, you can catch up by watching it right over there. Tap the subscribe button if you're new and turn on the notifications for our channel so you see all of our videos. The shop is right down there if you want to grab some merch and support this channel. And until next time, remember that anything is possible as long as you stay positive, work hard, and laugh at life. Love you guys.